poppin' y'all, welcome back to a new YouTube video, and today we are taking a look at something very, very cool. It is the Fortnite leaks for this week. We've had a new update, and the Jujutsu Kaisen skins are finally here, and we also have the uh, starter pack for Chapter 4, Season 4, I do believe it is. Uh, but we have two Itadori skins, uh, and there is a Jujutsu Kaisen Battle Pass, like there was for... Um, Star Wars and what there's going to be for Doctor Who, as we all speculated, as we all thought. Megumi does come with two dances, he comes with pickaxe and a backpack, and he has 1,900 V-Bucks, 1,800 V-Bucks, um, like, corresponding. Then we have, uh, Naomi, n n name, n n I don't know, the girl, the ginger one, she is 1,800 and Gojo is 1,500, and then Itadori is obviously 1,000, you get all the other Jujutsu Kaisen stuff, uh, all for that 1,000, and two Itadori skins. I currently have that right now, and I am working my way through the challenges, and there is two Jujutsu Kaisen weapons in the game as well. It is Gojo's big ball, and then Naomi's sort of hammer and sort of nails, which are very OP. I have played uh, a couple of rounds of Fortnite with Lolita, my girlfriend, and uh, we have used them, got some clips, going to be uploaded later on this week, maybe tonight even. Uh, but we do have a new teaser, and it's for WWE, and we have two new WWE skins coming into the game, and it is two wrestlers. I thought we already had WWE in the game when we got John Cena, but apparently not. We're getting more um, I don't watch WWE, I'm not too interested in WWE, so there is this. There is the starter pack for next season, though, looks really cool. It's like an orange robotic raptor, and I think that's so insane. It's just such a cool-looking skin, and I can't wait to get it. I always get the starter packs, you know. You get it for the 600 V-Bucks. It's such a good deal. Um, but yeah, here are the two wrestler skins on screen. Again, not too interested, I'm not going to get him. Moving back over to Jujutsu Kaisen, we do have a new lobby screen, which does have one of the Cursed Llamas, which is also one of the new items in the game right now. And you go over to it, and that's how you get Gojo's balls. They sort of get summoned by a rift, um, and then the you know you kill them like a normal llama. Uh, and yeah, that's how you get Gojo's big ball. The other weapon can be found also in the llama, but it can also be picked up from chests and floor loot. Uh, Itadori... Doesn't have a weapon, unfortunately, and same with Megumi. However, those two are my favorites, so I am quite upset that them themselves don't have their own special weapon. But here is the Jujutsu Kaisen little battle pass, the Break the Curse pass, and I think it's pretty cool. The rewards you get are really cool. You get the Cursed Power Charge, or the Cursed Energy Charge. You get a pickaxe, you get Itadori twice. Uh, I prefer him in his tracksuit, to be fair. Um, he does look a lot cooler in his tracksuit, and it is a separate skin, not a separate style, like it is for the clone troopers that we got in the other uh, Star Wars Battle Pass. Uh, but here is the main teaser image we got from Fortnite themselves, which shows all four skins all together quite nicely, and I think these skins are pretty cool. And I am going to get them later on this week when I go back down to LOLs to play some more Fortnite. But other than that, I hope you all enjoyed this YouTube video. See you all next one. Have a nice day and goodbye. Stay home and stay safe. See you in the next one. Done.